Tough words today from St. Bernard Parish District Attorney Perry Nakosha. I want it to be clear to the public that public corruption as well will never be tolerated as long as I'm DA. Just days after we reported a criminal probe was underway by the DA, a grand jury indicted a St. Bernard Parish contractor, his daughter, and a former high-ranking parish employee on a racketeering charge, alleging the three ran a criminal enterprise where they committed theft, money laundering, and bribery. Nakosha says Tony Mollier Sr., his daughter Alicia, and former Parish Road Department Chief Jared Gurges manipulated the sale of scrap metal to enrich themselves and rip off the parish. The way it worked was Anthony Mole received all the scrap metal. That was at the direction of the road supervisor who sent that scrap metal to Mole exclusively. That scrap metal was never weighed. That scrap metal was simply collected and resold by Mole with no funds or hardly any funds coming back to St. Bernard Parish. In return, uh, there is evidence uh, sufficient enough for this indictment to show that Jared Gurgis accepted bribe money in order to keep that scrap metal going to Mole uh, disposals. The indictments also come on the heels of a scathing legislative audit released last month. And the indictment unsealed on Thursday claims the value of scrap metal may have reached the millions of dollars, saying, despite selling over $8 million in scrap during 2013 and 2014, Anthony Mollier Sr. and Alicia Mollier Miller did not remit to St. Bernard Parish government money due to it from the sale of scrap metal, but instead converted it to their own use, the use of Jared Gurges, and the use of their racketeering enterprise.